Jazz Ehrenberg is used to making things colorful. This is not normally how she does it. Usually, it's a lot bigger. Her murals are part of the Baltimore community. I think that work in public really has more of an impact than people think, and I really think it's important that the community is involved. The pandemic has been a struggle for many artists. It is for jazz, but it's also allowed her to try something new, a coloring book. When I had this idea that it would actually get to print, um, but it did. Views from home started with Jazz's own view from home. You see, during the pandemic, she says she kept looking at this pile of stuff in her house. So she took a picture of it and then she sketched it. With that, a social media campaign was born. And I just started making posts about it and getting anybody to share it. It became so much bigger and people like really gravitated towards it. And so complete strangers started sending me photos. She took those pictures and put them on paper. She created a Baltimore edition. So the ones with animals ended up being very exciting for me. I wasn't expecting that necessarily, like this one with a cat in the doorway. And there's an international one. Jazz was surprised she received submissions from 16 countries around the world. So the international edition was built to be like a way of travel. One dollar of each book sold will be donated to the Artist Relief Fund. They've been supporting artists during the pandemic. I am one of those artists. Jazz says this whole thing has been gratifying and one of the best parts, seeing her work bring people together. I think that was the main goal was to have a project that brought people together in this uh, like secluded time, but also gave them something to do. That's a real masterpiece. In Baltimore, Megan Pringle, WBAL-TV 11 News. <laughs>